I'm Brian Kennedy and I'm here in St. Louis and as you can tell from the music that's playing and the confetti that is falling, the Cats are the SEC Tournament champs for the 31st time in program history. How did they get there? Let's take a look at some highlights. Winyan Gabriel was the man yesterday. Here he is again, keeping that block party from yesterday going. On the other end, he checked. That'd be his eighth straight three if you're keeping up, folks. Time taking down Sasha Kalia Jones, another guy that was big yesterday with a huge block when it comes down to clutch time. But on the other end, Balls Jordan Bell comes back down, sinks a huge three that banks in. Cats need a huge bucket, and here is Shea Gilders Alexander with a step back. Buckets. Cats would sink their free throws and win this one down the stretch. The Cats once again your SEC tournament champions for the 31st time in program history. It feels beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah, so, like yeah. a, oh, the baby. Oh, it's amazing. It's uh, the greatest tradition in college basketball. So coming here, uh, everybody knows what uh, goes around here. So you just gotta uh, just basically just work with your guys and just try to be family and just go get it on the court. That's my first time ever cutting down nets. I mean, my first time winning the championship. I didn't win one in high school, so it was a great feeling. I'm really happy right now. I mean. There's no better feeling than going up there on, stand, on them ladders and cutting down the net and waving into the stands. I mean, this is a great feeling, and I'm so proud of my teammates because we really came out and we played really hard this whole, the whole game. Um, that was the first time I've ever been under confetti. Um, <laughs> but it was kind of annoying. Uh, it, it, it was irritating on the skin. Um, I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't mind if they didn't put confetti anymore. But, uh, yeah, it was... I was happy. Like, it definitely means more. I mean, it feels like it feels like we've been on the up and down season. We've been through a lot. You know, we've been called a lot, saying we're not this, we're not that. You know, I feel like those four losses really made us as a team. Almost five losses in a row. You know, you know, we was first we had a players meeting. We came and talked about it. We sat it back, and uh, you know, we called it comeback season time. You know, we came back, we came together, and uh, we came back and got a, got some hard work. Coming up later, we'll have more from here in St. Louis. Until then, I'm Brian Kennedy, ABC 36 Sports.